most important prestigious tournament in the world for kids in Brazilian Jiu-Jitsu uh, is the, the Super Bowl of Jiu-Jitsu for Kids. 17 students made their way from Midland to compete in the 2023 Pan American Championship in Orlando. One of them is Maya Padilla, who is a two-time Pan American Kids Champion. Among her other accolades is the Brazilian National Championship and European Championship. Winning the gold is nothing new, but for her teachers and sensei, the excitement is always there. They were all like super excited and he's telling me good job, congrats, a lot of stuff. My sensei, he was really, really proud of me. And sensei Bastos was proud of all of his students, including his daughter Maria. Maria won the silver medal two years in a row. And even through the tough times of struggles, her father always uplifted her with a positive message. I like to say that life is a competition, uh, so every time that she experiences a loss, I remind her that's not uh, what, what tells her worth. Her worth is what she's going to do after every win and or loss. And through the hard work and perseverance, the seven-year-old Maria was triumphant this go-around, earning her first gold medal as a gray belt, which converts her to yellow. The win sparked plenty of emotion in her father. Um, I was hugging my dad. He was crying. I wanted to show him my medal, and I was thinking that he would be so excited. He said, good job, Juji. And after winning the gold, Maria, or Juji as her parents call her, had a request that will definitely come in a few years. I thought that he would um, put me in the adult class, but he never did. And as for Basso's jiu-jitsu, Bruno hopes each one of his students find a unique niche to achieve a pathway to success. That's why I always tell them about our winning culture, because if you try to be like everybody, you're going to have the same results as everybody. But when you set yourself apart, then you can stand out of everybody and then be uh, high level in whatever you choose to do.